Welcome back inside the Hall of Fame, man. Uh, we're getting close to wrapping this thing up. What we got, man? I know we probably got some questions. People. Yeah. Yeah, I know. We definitely have questions, but there are a couple other things that I actually wanted to run by you in regards to some things out there in the media. But the first one, um, I just think that she was your girl over there on uh, WWE backstage. And uh, Paige just announced that she... Um, she said, I posted something like this before, but I'm so proud of my progress. Two years of sobriety, and I feel good. So I just feel like we should shout out Paige yeah, for kind yeah. of getting back my on girl, track. Man. You know, That's my girl, man. Appreciate her um, actually um, sharing that. Um, that's the um, you know the most important thing about that is being able to share it because there's so many people walking in those same footsteps that see someone like Paige that look up to someone like Paige and say, man, I want to be like Paige and, and say, man, First thing I got to do is stop doing what I'm doing. That that that's very important. So many people hide, you know, behind that cloak and and make people think that they're um, you know something special that they're not. They don't have flaws. You know, um, you know, to be flawed is is something that every person, you know, um, deal with in life. Because I don't I don't I don't know one per perfect person. But to be able to you know share it with with, with the world um, to 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 save one person's life. Uh, perhaps it is so important. So uh, big ups to my my sister Paige, man. Uh, hopefully um, I'll see her soon. Uh, maybe she might be on uh, uh, talking smack with me because I need somebody um, with me that's going to be able to, you know, go toe to toe with me as far as being able to talk some smack. But yeah, yeah, definitely. Big you know, up. You know, you know Paige yeah. will talk. Paige, yeah, Paige going to talk. She's going to say her mind. Man. She'll go, man. She'll go. Yeah. Um, yeah. Did you know her very well before y'all did backstage? No, man, but I I, I didn't know her. But um, I, when we used to go to um, England, ever since, you know, I mean, back in the early um, days, uh, 2000s, um, Paige was running around the arena every time. You know, she was, I, I don't know. You know, our family was in the business, of course, and uh, mom, dad, and they got their own promotion over there. And um, I guess they had talent there as well, um, trying out whatever, you know, that was going to be extras for the show. And uh, Paige, little girl, man, she's always running around the arena, having fun. And uh, next thing you know, boom, there she goes uh, doing her thing, you know. So I didn't know her, but uh, I definitely saw her grow up. Um, just like I, I watched Stephanie McMahon grow up. It was funny sitting there with her uh, last week uh, on SmackDown, and she's sitting next to me. And, only thing I'm thinking about is this little bitty girl, you know, running around the arena, you know, that was, you know, you know, hey, Booker, <laughs> you know, and she was always just nice, you know, but that's that's, but now I look at her and I'm like, wow, man, you know, and I th and I think about my little girl at the same time, you know, growing up, boom, and next thing you know, and she's running the company, you know, next thing you know, she's taking the phone calls for reality of wrestling. It's just nuts. It just made me feel a certain way sitting there um, alongside of her. But, uh, yeah, it's awesome. awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is weird how, how crazy fast you grow up in the business. But, uh, yeah, shout out to Paige. That's a really that's a really big thing. And two years is a long time. You know what I mean? Two years is a long time when you're trying to get back on track. Yeah. So, uh, you know, all, all, our, all our best wishes out that way. I think we're all happy for her. And, yeah. Book, I know – I know we've talked about it before, but you got to see that movie about her life. You got to sit down and watch it because it's, I think it's the best wrestling movie. Well, I think the only reason I haven't watched it is uh, because The Rock is in it. <laughs> what? You like The Rock. I like The Rock. I just never watched any of his movies. Well, you're missing some real fun movies. I'll be honest with you. You never saw Scorpion King? No. The Rundown? No. Walking Tall? No. Race to Witch Mountain? No. Game Plan? No. Gridiron Gang? No. Nah. Fast and Furious 5? No. Nope. 6? Uh-uh. 7? Only, uh, only one I've watched uh, is uh, G.I. Joe. Oh, you are, so the, out of all the movies you picked, G.I. Joe Retaliation to watch. It was, because of, of it. It was because of Joe. It wasn't because of him. You know what I mean? I like the Joes. Yeah. 